It's beer o'clock on Real Craft Beer. Today we've got a bottle of Abbey Des Rocks Blonde coming in at 7.5% ABV. It's a triple fermented Belgian blonde ale. Here's a look at the label. There's the bottle cap. Let's get the beer out into a glass, see what we get. Blue bottle cap, I should mention. Oh, look at the smoke on the opening. Boom! Beer in the glass then. I do like a Belgian blonde, to be honest. Oh my goodness me. This happened, I reviewed another kind of light style beard from these guys before. Did I say beard? Beer. Um, look at that, that is absolutely incredible. There's shopping trolleys, tires, washing machines, there's all sorts thrown into that glass. Uh, golden in colour, massive, massive chunks of suspended yeast or massively unfiltered beer. One finger whitehead, nice levels of carbonation. Belgian beers, I mean, they're, they're built to, well, generally most of them are built that you throw the yeast in, so I've not done anything wrong here. Um, don't be alarmed though. The beard is full of vitamin B when it's like this. I'm gonna get the aroma on this golden colored speckled beer. It smells okay. Typical blonde. Nice fruitiness coming through, candy, candy kind of sugar, candied fruit. Malt backbone. Biscuity, bready, malty backbone coming through. Lots of spice, lots of lemon. And a slightly perfumed aroma. Let's dive in. Cheers. Nothing wrong with it. Typical blonde beer. I say nothing wrong with it because I mean obviously if you're new to beer and you're looking at that, you're thinking, my goodness me, why is he drinking that? But honestly, as my friend Hopseen would say, that's a dirty, dirty beer. Um, I agree, I agree, it's a dirty looking beer, but it tastes okay. <sighs> Biscuity, bready, nicely carbonated. Lemon, spiciness, candied sugar, candied fruit. Easy drinking for 7.5% ABV. It's sliding down. Drinking like a, a regular kind of 5% ale, which is the magic of Belgian beer. A little bit of alcohol warming as the beer's hitting the pit of the stomach. But it's good. It's a good beer. I'm going to rate it. Uh, natural beer with yeast, pure malt and hops. Uh, Brasserie de la Abbey des Rocks, Belgium. Where are they based in Belgium? Uh, Montigny's sur Rocks, Belgium. There you go. 330 bottle. I am going to take one mark away for it being dirty. <laughs> it is it is very very off putting um, in terms of in terms of if you look at the beer. It, it's I mean let's have another look at it. Look at that. That's that's bonkers. I mean no brewer in their right mind would choose to ha to have their beers to look like that. But it's just the way it is. It's, it's Belgian beer, but it's probably the dirtiest Belgian beer that I've ever had. Also. Um, so I'm going to take a mark off for that, but uh, other than that, it's it's a solid Belgian blonde ale, a 7 out of 10. It's a 7 out of 10 from Relo Craft Beer, please put your comments in the comments box, subscribe to our daily beer reviews, give us a big fat thumbs up, boom, and cheers.